<sighs> Mentos, the fresh maker. Mm. This is not a Mentos advertisement, but this is one of the best gums I've ever had. Why the heck am I talking about Mentos gum? I don't know, it just seemed like the right thing to do. No, but really, as I go along and find different things that I think you guys may be uh, interested in or will benefit from, one of them is gum. You know, the problem is everybody chews gum. Now, this is pretty rude for me chewing gum like this on camera. That's what you normally do right in the parking lot. Please don't do that. Why am I talking about this? Because somehow somebody's gum got on the bottom of my shoe and got on the inside of the car. Yeah. So, but it's a really, really good opportunity to show you how to remove gum from your interior. Now, it's very simple. There's really only two things that you need. I have a brand new just a shop towel. You can use any type of towel. Don't use a good microfiber because you're gonna kind of throw this away after you're done with it. And this is the Citrol I've showed you in the windshield cleaning video. Uh, I'm gonna put a link to this in Amazon. This is the absolute best degreaser I've ever found. This stuff is phenomenal. It's made from oranges, from orange peels. It's It will remove tar, gum, adhesive it is amazing what this stuff will do I mean, you just need just a, just a little bit to do it now I've got a spray bottle right here that I have the citrol in these are really nice spray bottles they're resistant to this degreaser and they don't leak I'm gonna put a put a link in Amazon too I keep this and use this all the time so you know what I can sit here and talk about it. Let me just show you what I've got going on. There it is. I've got a wad of gum right there. Not the worst place I could ever have it on, but it's on the floor mat and it's partly on the foot rest. So I'm going to be taking the citrol and doing a cleanup on that. First, I'm gonna pull the floor mat out. All right, so I'm gonna cut to the shot down here and we're gonna get the gum residue that's on the floor mat off first. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my cloth that I have and I'm going to squirt some of the citrol, about a silver dollar size area. And I'm just gonna take it and rub it on the gum. Now, I actually don't know if this is Mentos or not, but I like Mentos. And it will come off just like that. What's really nasty is this was in somebody's mouth. Now, this is not going to hurt the plastic. It won't hurt the rubber. You just don't want to leave it on there. The other, the other alternatives for, remo for removing gum is to freeze it, and that just takes too long. Okay. So that's off just like that. All right, next we're going to be working on the wad right there. And hopefully, this is kind of hard to do by yourself with the camera. But I'm going to do the same thing I did before. I'm going to get a clean area. And just squirt the citrol directly on the cloth. I, I don't recommend just squirting it wildly all over your plastic. 
but this you can see it just basically popped off it's this stuff was really really sticky and i am going to pick this up because i don't want it in there again i'm going to put a little bit more citrol on here i'm sorry if i'm getting in the way it's almost impossible to do with the camera behind you but anyway there it's completely off in the past, as like I've said, I've used different types of, you know, lacquer thinner and goof off and you name it, bug and tar remover, and it just does not work as well as the the citrol does. It doesn't, and it leaves a nice smell. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take a um, another another one of these cloths and just put some water on there and just get the residue off right there and that'll be it so guys i hope this helped you if you have gum stuck on your any any part of your interior even if it's carpet and if i have a chance to have another wad of gum stuck somewhere i will show you guys how to remove it with the citrol and i'll put a link to everything i use down below and i will see you guys on the next video